In January, the Dean of Students at the University of Tennessee moves to Wake Forest. Dr. Shea Kid Brown started almost four years ago. She helped push for more diversity and inclusion across the campus, and reporter Grace King spoke with her about changes she hopes will stick. The very thing that's central to me is the very thing I'll miss, which is the people. In Dean Shea's office, letters of gratitude and thanks line the wall. One of the things I'm most proud of is our focus on mattering and belonging. Her goal four years ago was to make the University of Tennessee feel like home for every student. Really creating a culture where students are using that language, where they say, you know, this is a place where my story is important, where I have significance. And that was something that I was a part of. Four years later, she's proud of the culture she helped create. Maybe that's the legacy that I've left is that a campus that's approaching 32,000 doesn't feel that big and that people can walk to class and, you know, meander and get to know their faculty and know administration. Dean Shea took a unique approach to her job, hosting events like Milkshake Monday and Quarantine with the Dean. This work is not situated in an office, but it really is getting to know our students, our faculty, our staff, our alumni, and really working together to live out the volunteer creed. As Dean Shea begins her new adventure, she says she'll miss the people and the orange. There's so much spirit and enthusiasm about Big Orange Country, so I'm definitely going to miss, you know, just the long traditions. This place is 227 years old, and so there's a lot that comes with that. That was Grace King reporting in 2022, 2020, I should say. Dean Shea was recognized as an SEC leader for embodying the spirit and drive of Black History Month.